Hello and welcome to Flossport International. Let's take a look at what is happening in the African Cup of Nations. Now, Cape Verde becomes the first team to qualify to the last 16 of the ongoing Africa Cup of Nations. They did so by beating Mozambique three goals to nil. The victory is the second. In their opening match, they won 2-1 against uh, Ghana and now they have registered a 3-0 victory over Mozambique. Now, this result means that they have secured the top spot in Group B. They are leading with six points in Group B of uh, the Continental Showpiece. Now, Mozambique were not a match at all, at all uh, for Cape Verde. Cape Verde came in, did whatever they needed to do and carried all the three points. And now they have to wait for their last match uh, which is going to be against Egypt and uh, Mozambique now are still without a win in the African in, in the history of the African Cup of Nations. Now, uh, in the last match, the the last group match, uh, we'll see uh, Cape Verde take on uh, Egypt. Now, I don't see how Egypt is going to beat Cape Verde, but you know, uh, in in Kenya, we always say um, Pira Hudunda, but I don't see how this is going to Dunda. Why? Uh, because we're talking about an Egypt that was held to a 2 2 draw by Mozambique, the same Mozambique that has been beaten, uh, that has been whooped three goals to nil uh, by Cape Verde. Clearly, uh, you know, in my earlier videos, you can go and check, especially on TikTok and on, on, on YouTube, I had talked of uh, Cape Verde becoming a top dog and not by fluke. They deserve to be top dogs at this particular point, uh, at least in the in the group stage, and in Group B to be uh, to be very specific because we still have a long way to go in the African Cup of Nations. Uh, and now this is what will happen: Mozambique uh, will take on Ghana, and Egypt is hoping that they beat Cape Verde, which uh, for for the sake of argument, let's just say that, that is what they they'll have to hope for. But I don't see it happening. Uh, in my opinion, and they have to hope also that the match beating um, Mozambique and Ghana ends in a stalemate. So there is no guarantee for Egypt. It's all mathematics and hoping that uh, the result goes otherwise on the other match. Uh, so uh, congratulations to Cape Verde. They progress to the uh, next phase, the last scene of the competition, deservedly. As for Egypt, they have to pull their socks and hope that um the other match ends in a stalemate so that they qualify as the second team in group b thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video